hey guys welcome back to the channel this is love i am your um posh boss boss <laughs> stepping into the club now i know you notice me wanna be your metal first prize although you she let's turn the lights up let me get my whole look together all right let's start the intro again my name is Love Davis. If you guys have never seen me before, I am um, a savvy hanger on the Poshmark website. I believe that Macari is, and I should have my phone in front of me, and I don't forgive me. I just wanted to come and film this because I totally forgot. Um, and I started posting. I think I listed two of the items that I'm getting ready to show you anyway, but neither here nor there. Um, two things to know. Number one, I'm going to put the Instagram. Make sure you follow me over on Instagram and watch my stories as I unfold, as I show the unfolding of this whole entire process and closet. Um, I'm doing a total rebrand of what my Poshmark closet used to look like and um, just trying to just make sure I stay consistent with 2019. I have some goals to hit um, and my retail triangle must be hit on all three points. Already three minutes into me talking and I apologize. I apologize. But I wanted to take you on my Poshmark journey. Um, I've been watching other people's videos and I find them so fun. So I thought that I would bring my winning personality and smile and style to you via YouTube. So we're on the same page. All right. I don't know if I have an intro for Poshmark. So I am sitting here. You guys see my Saint Love tea. Let me show you. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. All right, so this is my Saint Love tea. This will be in the boutique very soon, um, but you can check it out over on, so it's on my regular website, which is amorechic.com. I will put it down here at the bottom, but this comes in two colors. This is the way that it comes um, as far as the font. So I usually, you'll see me in this in pink. It's fluorescent pink or fluorescent green. It is one of my faves. Hi, so I am sitting here in my little picture um, studio for Poshmark or just where I do inventory and things and I am here with this week's haul so this is um, the first week of February so I did this haul over the weekend of the first second and third actually I did it all on the second so let me not try to pretend like I um, did this over the course of several days so this is the first February haul for Poshmark and eBay um, actually and Macari so those are the three platforms that I am simultaneously, sorry guys, you know I'm finicky about my hair, I apologize for being so finicky, um, but those are the ones that I am really, really, really passionate about. What you see behind me is something that will go up um, over the weekend, so that'll be in next week's haul, but it is a boutique item that is behind me. So, everything that I'm going to show you today... <clears throat> For the Poshmark closet or the eBay closet or the Macari closet is going to be new with tags. So I will start with this first thing and I've not popped the tags off of here. Um, this is a boutique brand called Monte, Monto, Monte, but it is a really cute red camisole. Again, is this red cami. Look how cute that is. New with tags. It is a boutique brand called Monte, Monto. Next up, we have this cloth and stone kind of tank. And it almost, it's like a, a denim, but it's not really a denim. It's really, really, really like a soft um, cotton. It's got keyhole back. And it is just absolutely cute. It is in a size um, small. But I got that from Cloth and Stone, which of course is an anthropology brand. I will make sure, now, I can tell you right now, in life, my two favorite brands are Free People and, um, um, sorry, I'm trying to pull this thing out, um, Free People and Lucky, like, literally, that bohemian slide of me is that, but I'm really a street style girl. A lot of what you see, I'm sorry, I feel like I'm really finicking with my hair, and I apologize. Hold on. This short, these short hair chronicles are crucial, and this video is not for look or style. It is just to show you what's going on in my closet. Um, but um, Lucky Brand and Free People are like my... 
those are like I'm really street style but like that other side of me that bohemian slash comfy cozy athleisure side of me so though that's my triangle I'm like at the top I'm street style on one side of me um, I'm very freestyle lucky brand bohemian like a lot of off the shoulder prints and on the other side of me is very athleisure like leggings and a cute little sports top and I'm ready to go so that is my style triangle Tell me what your style triangle is. All right, so I got a cute little cable and gauge tank. It's like a sweater tank. It is absolutely cute. I literally love the print on that. Next, we have a William Rass. Now, I remember when William Rass came out and Justin Timberlake and that whole kind of stepping into male, um, stepping into that whole designer arena. I've been around for a really long time, boo. Um, but I love the graphic on this. This is this speaks to my street style side of me. It has the cold shoulder detail. But I absolutely love that from William Rast. Next up, we um, and that is the size. I'm sorry. Let me tell you the sizes. Um, and I probably missed the size on the other thing. This was a size medium. So the William Rast is a size medium, and the cable and gauge is a size large, which is the tank top I just showed. All right, Lucky Brand, size large. This is such a cute top. Again, the bohemian side of me. I would rock this with some really cute jeans and some booties. And that's the, so I guess I would be bohemian at the top and very street style at the bottom. Um, this is a Lucky Brand, size large. And I cannot remember the name of this shirt, but it will be up there. But look at how it is giving me all kinds of bohemian vibes. Okay. Next up, if I could fit this, I would have kept it, but I'm a little busty, so I could not, and I can't remember who this is. Who is this? Oh, this is just a Hollister um, bra. This is just a Hollister workout bra. I just thought it was really, really, really cute. It's very well made, um, and I just thought I would add that to the athleisure side of the site. Have that. I have a Lucky Brand t-shirt that I thought was so cute it is a size large and it's taking everything in me not to wear it so this is a lucky brand t-shirt it says sunrise look how cute that is I, listen you'll find a mini a t-shirt on my website I love graphic tees period point blank exclamation point they're always on my website all right next up was something that I wasn't really going to pick up but I love all of the things but you can style this up and I have jewelry that goes with this so I'm going to style this up. Um, all of the tops will have jewelry associated with it because um, if you do not know, I sell paparazzi jewelry and usually I try to do on trend. And so to add jewelry to the pieces just is like an extra kind of style. Like I just wanted to give you a little bit more ways to style it and what kind of jewelry you can wear with it. And so um, a paparazzi jewelry is all $5. And so yeah, like thought I would do that I started that business for a hundred dollars I'll put a link in there to give you a little bit more information about that but jewelry comes with all the tops starting um this month so for 2019 every top will have a piece of jewelry that comes with it so this is the style of this particular top I just thought it was a cute little it's um Amer it's vintage America which I believe is a boutique brand I am not sure. I will let you know. But it's Vintage American Blues. I just thought this was a cute little top. It's got lace detail right here. And I love the bottom. Again, to rock with your flare jeans um, or your skinny jeans. To rock with your flare or your skinny jeans. And, um, yeah. So, we are not putting these up yet. This is a boutique item. I'm not ready to list just yet. I don't know how it made it to that pile. All right, next up, we have a splendid off-the-shoulder shirt in a size, um, what size is this? A size large. You know, I love a good off-the-shoulder shirt. You can be any shape, size. Off-the-shoulder shirts are always going to flatter you no matter what. Remember, I told you that. You're never too big or too small to do off-the-shoulder shirts. This is like the sexiest part of the body and so again accent it with a beautiful necklace mm. so this is just a splendid kind of off the shoulder short sleeve top all right so i'm going to continue next up we have this we the free free people tea that i love 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 like um there is a little bit of like distress that i love about this um also in 
the sleeves so it's just a really cute oversized it is a size medium but it is a really cute oversized deep vt that um i am probably going to list for like twenty dollars but i just thought it was really cute again i love free people i love the oversized fit i love so many things about it all right so this is an alternative tank and why did i pick this up because I thought it was cute to go under a really cute like pink blazer or a denim blazer. But it's just a really basic um, gray and dark gray tank. And I'm probably going to list that on eBay for like $13, $14. Alright, next up we have this Lucky Brand um, tee. It has a little bit of makeup on it so I've got to do a little bit of work to get it off. But it is totally cute. Look how it's a cute little flowy top. So there is the makeup here. So I'll have to do a little bit of work and get the makeup off. But I just thought this was so cute. This is what the sleeves look like. So I just thought this was totally adorable. Um, This is a size medium. If it was a large, we would be fighting for me to keep it. But it is a size medium. Um, This top will go up probably um, at the end of the week when I get the stain out. The makeup stain out. All right, next we have a, this is called Nine Brighton, and I'm assuming that it is a boutique brand, but it is super cute. It is a sweatshirt with stars, which if you guys can see the distressed stars throughout, love a good gray sweatshirt. Like you literally can go wrong, no, wrong with no sweatshirts, like closet staples, sweatshirts in all kinds, because you can do so much with them as far as rocking them with denim. As far as putting them under blazers for work to wear with pencil skirts, like there is so much. I do so much with um, sweatshirts. It's just not even funny. All right. So, again, probably going to list that for like $20, $25 on the website. All right. This, up, this next item is a boutique item, and it actually does come with labels. This is mine. Um, but I wanted to pull it out because the rest of them are packaged. And it is a mesh bodysuit. I wanted you to look at all the details. It is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It is a boutique brand called Emory Park, which is one of my favorites. But look at all the detail. Now, I'll put the sizing in there. It has a snap closure in the front, but it is gorgeous. The back is all mesh. And it is a beautiful bodysuit. Like, literally one of my favorites. So that is going to be in the boutique this week. Um, there, This is another brand. What is this called? Jack by Dakota. Jack by BB Dakota. Love, love, love the print of this. Look at that. Look at the back. It is see-through sheer. It is high-low. It is totally the cutest damn shirt I've seen in a really long time. Um, it is long sleeves, of course, with the bell sleeve, and it's got the elastic sleeve. This is super, super, super cute. I have no idea how much I am going to sell this for. I'm going to do the comps. Um, I got to do the comps and see what that brand goes for. Next up, I have a Vineyard Vines black velvet um, sleeveless shell, and this is currently on their website. And I want to tell you, um, it has the keyhole back. And I thought that this was also extra cute. Um, it is currently on their website, so I'm going to probably price it just a little bit under what they have on the website. Next up was a statement piece I just thought you could have. It is a, a, a boutique brand called Time and Honey. And again, it is a mock neck. But I love the rib detail. I mean, the gathered detail of the mock neck. I just think this is so cute to go under so much. It is soft. It is super, super, super casual and casual vibes. Oh my God. Love this with your favorite athleisure, um, with your favorite athleisure, um, bottoms and maybe some rain boots, hunter boots, or even if you wanted to do like a rider boot look. So, so, so cute. This is definitely going to top that off. Next up, we have this bralette from Free People, which I thought was so cute. Look at it. I'm not holding it right, but it is a... Look how cute that is, though. So that is a bralette. I'm going to pull the comps. Um, the regular price for this was $38. So I'll probably put it up, list it for like $20. Something like that for a cute little bralette. Next up, we have this Paige Denim top that has like... 
this whole like sleeve detail kind of hang off the shoulder um, I'm gonna pull the comps for this too but I love page denim cute little printed like asymmetrical top it is a size medium but it is a truly cute little asymmetrical top size medium um, page denim love the print side of that next up we have this Ellen Tracy shell which ugh, love first of all I love 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 the neck look at the neck with the keyhole love that it is literally just a shell another sweatshirt from a brand called Theo and Spence which is the cutest little dog on the front and it is the softest t-shirt I mean the softest sweatshirt ever oh look at my hair it is the softest sweatshirt ever in life look at that it is the coziest oh the cozy 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 all right next up because I'm trying not to make this video too long is a free people is this free people lucky bread free people this is called the dock street top and this is actually still up I believe on the website but it has this little kind of keyhole back detail just love it it's got a lot of extra like it's got kind of the so here is the three-quarter sleeve and then there's also like this extra like panel in the back if you can just see the way that it's shaped it is such a cute little top the pictures do it so much justice the stock photos of that like I can't you can't get the same thing from hanging up all right we're almost down to the wire next up is a we the free by free people size medium off the shoulder lilac top it is first of all totally on trend for spring 2019 colors I cannot think it what is it princess what is the purple color I can't remember but it's like a lilac color I, I just know that there's a really pretty like lilac color I can't remember what the name of it is for the trend um, but I will it definitely is on trend with the color schemes so it is a size medium which you know is totally off the shoulder um, and totally large for a free people top so yeah I know I probably didn't show that too too well but it is really 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 cute next up we have one more free people item you know I told you I love free people um, and it is their top actually I think this is still on their website as well um, this is all stone in the front of it the detail of that it is long sleeve very bohemian the back has all the buttons um, and it is totally cute look at the top like look at the the neckline it's gonna be so pretty and with like wood jewelry or just since, since it already has all the stones in the front a nice piece of wood jewelry in the front is going to be amazeballs love this so yep I can't remember the name of this top but this top is like two hundred and twenty eight dollars online um no it's not it's 168 online sorry I, some one of these tops something was like two hundred twenty eight dollars I couldn't even believe it all right I have a cloth and stone that does not have the original tags on it however it is brand new so it is a cloth and stone size large plaid um, I can't remember what plaid it was but it is a plaid shirt um, I have the stock images of this as well it's got fringe detail at the bottom totally buttoned up love the color of the plaid so I was excited when I grabbed that as well and my last but not least item is a boutique piece is this my shirt though or is this oh this is a small this might be my shirt this is a totally large so I told you I really love graphic tees so over at a more sheet that street side of me graphic tees is an absolute staple and this is the shirt that goes so I call this the American girl tee but it is the California tee it's got an extreme large deep V and it has the um piece of fabric that comes across the neck like this so I wear mine with my jewelry underneath of that part so that um, it doesn't kind of when I even when you bend over like it doesn't fall out so this um, it's actually there's one shirt that's part of a bundle but the rest of them are going to be for sale it has the split sides as well and it has all of the distress that you need on the front and the distress details on the back if you can see it there with the keyhole distress the distress keyhole details and the sleeves have a cuff that is stitched together. So this was just one of my favorite. Again, this is from Emory Park, which is one of my favorite boutique brands. I have a lot of pieces from Emory Park that I'm going to start uploading. Um, and to top it off, all of the piping, the stitch 
one here like this was just one of my favorite 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 tees it is extremely oversized and it will definitely be up on the Poshmark site um so that is it guys that is my haul for the first week of February I will see you guys next week with another haul and it'll probably be a goodwill haul I'm going to the bins for the first time this week um, or actually, yeah, this weekend I'm going to the Benz for the first time. So hopefully I find some goodies like everybody else does. But until then, see you guys later. Bye, my loves. Um, if you have any questions, comments, issues, make sure you put them down below. Make sure you follow all of my social media and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Let's turn the lights up. Turn it out, turn it out. You and me like a face up. Building up,